Hello everyone. Today we are checking out the demo for Expeditions Rome, an isometric turn-based CRPG that is coming out on the 20th of January 2022. So if you're interested, you don't have long to wait at all. So let's just dive right in. Let's make a new game. In the year of Lucius Licinius Lucullus, Rome was prosecuting several wars of self-defense, most notably in Greece, where Lucullus himself was commanding the legions. With everyone's gaze directed at the provinces, few could have known that a seemingly inauspicious event in Rome would become the central fulcrum around which the fate of the Republic would turn. The paterfamilias of a venerable patrician house had passed away unexpectedly, and a senator by the name of Vitellius Skyewola had made a bid for the hand of his eldest child. His widow alone believed that Skyewola had poisoned her husband, and now strove to take his place and claim his property through marriage. Acting in secret, the widow arranged for her youngest child to be taken out of their villa in the dead of night and smuggled out of Rome. No, oh, alright. Here we are, dumped right into character creation. Cool. It would be male given names. In Roman society, women were not given first names. Oh, that's interesting. I did not know that. Looks like we get to select. We don't have to choose one. And we can, of course, do a male character. You do have given names. I have a few options over here. Not a lot. I don't know if there'll be more in the full version. Looks like we get to choose the portrait. Let's take a look at those. <laughs> okay. Looks a little... Okay, we're back around. Okay. All right. Hmm. Back around. I don't know if that is all we're going to have or if there'll be more in the uh in the full game let's who knows it's interesting they allowed us to have a female character um in this game and at all so let's let's try it and see we have your faces and now try that one get skin colors Hairstyle, two or three hairstyles, some hair colors. We don't have a, a lot of options to pick from here. And a lot of them don't seem to mesh well with the portraits that we were given, though maybe there'll be more portraits in the full game. Who knows? I guess it's isometric view, so we're not going to be seeing our characters in epic cutscenes. That's not really what this game is about. This portrait will pop up in dialogue. So let's see. Uh, that's good enough. And continue, I guess. Oh, oh no. Okay. Things we can pick, I guess, to use to persuade people or get them to do what we want. Let's be a brat. <laughs> no. Yeah, we're just we're just totally going normal. I'm not turning on permadeath, and I'm not doing Iron Man. It's cool that those options are available for people who like it, but that's just not what we need to do for this. Did you hear me, Domina? Your body is surely present, but your mind seems somewhere else. Hi. Our departure was very sudden, I know. But do not dwell on the past. 
Better to focus on what's coming at you. I asked the Triarchus how close we are to Lesbos, but uh, he would not give me a straight answer. Indeed. In his defense, there are many islands on this sea, and they mostly look the same. Will you check with the Triarchus? Hopefully he will give you a clearer answer. He told me his name is Geminus. Okay, so, right, we can't even pick the ones that we don't have, so it's not like you can try and fail either, so... You were the authority of your ancestors well. I'm sure he'll give you what you want. <laughs> you should also go and thank Quintus Aquilinus. I do believe he saved our lives with his timely appearance at the villa. Okay, sure. Well, let's ask the question. Your mother paid first. Geminus handsomely to set off in great haste under cover of night. Two others did board with us, also bound for Lesbos. Young Gaius has been pacing impatiently over there, wearing grooves into the deck. There was a gladiator too, but I don't know where he went. Oh, well, we left so quickly. Do not worry. The Witellius brothers have no reason to do them any harm. Besides, you cannot save them by worrying. Focus on the task ahead. Thank you for bringing me along. It will be wonderful to see my homeland again. Okay, so we have... I guess we're in a little tutorial zone here. Pretty typical, I guess. Okay, let's see if we can find this guy we need to talk to. There you are. Hello. You found your sea legs quickly, Domina. Yeah. You handle the sea better than most. I'm glad. Alright. The timing was fortunate, but there is no need to thank me. The console sent me to get you. Please, call me Kaiser, if it's not too familiar. My subordinates call me Kenturio, my superiors call me Aquilinus, my friends call me Kaiser. With all due respect, I'd better not. <laughs> ah, she did not keep you apprised. Your mother has secretly been making arrangements with the Consul. You will, of course, not participate in the war in any capacity. You are a woman. Wow. Hmm. I'm sure you can find something to help out with around the camp, if you get bored. One word of advice. I know Lucullus is a friend of your family, but remember, he is the consul, elected by the people to rule all of Rome. It's best if you don't act too familiar with him in front of his men. For many years, I was the Primus Pellis of Legio Prima Italica, which he commands. He needed someone he could trust to get you out of Rome and keep you safe. That position has already been filled by one of my Centurionis. A good man, easily up to the task. My job now is to watch your back and help you settle into your new life. Yeah, that doesn't seem like much of a promotion. <laughs> I said the consul, and he has well earned my loyalty. Like to ask all the questions. I had a brief talk with that gladiator who boarded before us, just to make sure he won't give us any trouble. He seems to have vanished, though. The young man over there, Gaius, is apparently the nephew of the other consul, Marcus Aurelius Cotta. He's here to become a tribunus, a mostly ornamental position intended for young patricians to learn about military affairs. Okay, it looks like question marks do exactly that. They don't necessarily have to be questions, but they're information. The other arrows, the little, kind of progress the, the conversation, so. Let's go. Let's see. There's the other guy, I guess, that I can talk to. Doesn't look like you can interact with too much. At least not a... I heard she's running zone. from a senator who wants her dead. Shh, keep your voice down. Okay, guy, okay, let's just hold still for him. Solway. Mm. 
It is a pleasure. I am Gaius Julius Caesar. Not at all. But keep in mind, I'm not the most experienced soldier either. I was born in Rome, but they say my family is from Alba Longa. You don't know? That's the okay. long story, my friend. Suffice to say, the powers that be are not fond of me. I have decided that staying in Rome could be, shall we say, hazardous to my health. To be honest, this will be my first proper battle. I did study a lot, though, and therefore I am well versed in matters of strategy and tactics. Okay, this is my first military engagement. <clears throat> if you don't play an important part, you will be torn apart. My father used to say, I guess that was his way of telling me to be brave and hopefully not stupid. <laughs> did it work? Oh. All right, here's our quest log. We've done the optional one already. Now we just have to do the rest of it. So let's go talk to this guy. Where are you? There he is. Right. It's pretty. What is he looking for? He's been like this all morning. Hmm. Yes, Geminus. So, uh, I'm a little preoccupied. Can okay, we have these? Forgive me, I did not intend any disrespect. We have only a short time left to go. If not for the lack of wind, we would be there already. But I will push the rowers harder. Wait. They're headed straight towards us. They're gonna ram. Get your father's weapons. Let's see if you're as formidable a woman as Lucullus said. Uh. Are you alright? I'm fine, Kenturio. Form up. Oh, okay. So we get the setup ship. before we do anything. That's good. To know. Okay. Heavy in front. Archers in support and back. Yeah. Makes sense. Alright. Let's see. Oh man. It looks like we got a lot of guys. Okay. Alright. How are you? Okay, so we can do this by mousing over. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Yep. Okay. That's good to know. Okay, so we can move, attack. All right. Okay. There's my. There's there's us. All right. I'm a patrician right now. Don't have too much. He is heavy. Okay, so he's our heavy guy. This is the port. And he's an archer. Okay. Okay. Heavy man. Let's get you. And where are you? Where's heavy man? Heavy man is right there. Let's move you up. I don't know. I don't know. Um, just stay here. Support man. Maybe it's support man over here. I, I don't really have no idea. Let's see. Okay. Archer guy. Uh. Alright, I'll move you back just a little bit. We'll see how this works. <laughs> Alright. Attacking. Okay. Let's select which skill to use. Some cost action points. Some of them to charges. Okay. Okay, diamonds and squares. Alright. Okay. Now let's start with Arthur and see if we can get rid of some of these guys. He's got crippling shot. Put a seven piercing damage. Deflected by shields. Okay, they want me to shield guy. 
Applies cripple. Okay, okay, okay. And aimed shot. Of course, then piercing damage deflected by shields. Just applies a different um, effect, I guess. Okay. Let's see, hardened enemies. I guess a hardened enemies the ones with shields. I don't know. Do. I had a bit of damage to him. Let's give it a go. I'm gonna get ready. Oh. Okay, there's a status effects. Positive, negative, or neutral. What is a neutral status effect? Yeah, I don't know. Okay. How did we do? Um. Okay, let's move you up to... Where do we want to go? Where do we want to go with you? Let's get you in. I don't want to get a tag of opportunity, but I do want to get you into the fray. So... Right here. Ah, what can you do? You can shield push. Okay, 35 bludgeoning damage. Which is a target, one hex away, if there's free space. And requires the minimum of one shield strength. Okay. 34 slashing damage. Also hit Jenny anime on the target's left for half damage. I don't think that guy has anybody on his left, so that's a shame. Looks multiple targets. Well shoot. Okay, well, that's fine. We'll just we'll just do what we can. Oh, and he has this. Embrace. Looks like it buys to himself. Uh, regen's stacks are strong. For each stack, 25% of the character's shield strength maximum is restored. At the beginning of their turn. Okay. okay. Alrighty, let's do... Well, let's just try to take some of these guys out. 100% chance. Good. I mean, I don't think we did too much. And here's the support. He has logistics. Area effect. Three hexes. Hex multiple targets. Supplies coordinated to allies. Plus two movement speed maximum. Oh, that sounds good. Okay, he's gonna have to move up though. Uh, okay, can you move up and not get yourself killed in the process? That'll do it. Alright. I think that'll hurt everybody. Get the, uh, probably didn't. <laughs> probably should have done that first. Alright. Oh, I can punch someone. I have no weapon. 3 or 4 bludgeoning damage. <laughs> okay. Um. 5 slashing damage. Affects multiple targets. Also, has any target. Uh, <laughs> targets? Also, it's any enemy on the target's left. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, okay, well, I guess I'm gonna need to do something. Let me get up here. Let's see where I can go, where can I go? I need to go. Look off of that. Alright. Let me go up here. And let's try slashing this guy. What do we do? Ugh, he's still alive. Oh, shoot. Okay, anybody? Anything else we can do? Doesn't look like it. Alright, I guess we'll end our turn and see. Let's <laughs> see what happens. Ah, see? Yeah. I think I can get behind them. No, don't. Don't get behind me. No, no, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm gonna be killed. Your father was right to teach you how to fight. Oh, no. Just don't kill me. Where is that gladiator who boarded with us? Up there.
Never underestimate the value of an impressive entrance. Right. Okay, so my turn again. Excellent. Yeah, 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 yeah. I am <laughs> not in good shape. Uh -huh. Uh, let's see. Man. Um, <laughs> do this. Kill this guy. Just kill him and get him out of the way. If we can kill him. Are you gonna- Oh, he can't see me. Oh, no. My character must be standing in the way. Well, that's not good. Okay, can you come up here? Oh. Oh, okay. Whenever you kill or incapacitate an untrained character, make a civilian or militia, in this case, um, something, the character who dealt the fatal blow will regain a oh, attack actions. Oh, good. Need to know. Uh, you can only use a skill force. Yeah, okay. Alright, well. In that case, what I am going to do right here, because is I want to kill this guy. If I can. I know he's not hardened, but too bad. I'm going to get him out of here because if I don't, my poor moron is gonna get get dead, and that is not awesome. <laughs> That I'll learn you. <laughs> Alright. How about you? Uh, get out of the way so you can hopefully not die and still be useful the next turn. Okay, we have our new guy here. What is he gonna do? What has he got? He's got one, two. 26 piercing damage. Generates two focus. Makes two attacks each. Half damage and precise stab, which is three to five piercing damage. That's three to five piercing damage as well. Now three to six. Generates one focus. Cannot be blocked or resisted. Oh, that's good. That's nice. Right, there's a guy. There's a guy. It's facing this guy. It's good with this. So, if there's only. Let's go here. This is all too easy. Uh, is it? Uh, uh, you? What are you doing? There's a guy. There's a guy there. This is going to out. Let's just see if you can. Yeah, he's almost dead. So let's try to take out this guy. Still standing. Impressive. Yes. Yes. Okay. Oh man, I keep forgetting to use this guy and give him stuff. But maybe he can do something else. Uh, don't oh no oh no oh no he had to go around the whole freaking map okay <laughs> so gets attacks of opportunity well for fucking sake well you killed that guy anyway so that's good but that was really not good I didn't think about having to go all around here so good job good job okay we used everybody now he can still do something. Cause I'm an idiot. <laughs> Good job, support man. <laughs> he says support man can't be can't be good. Have action points? Uh what 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 what? Okay. Okay. I don't know, just, just do this. Is that he can still do that? Does that do it? Yes. No, no, don't hurt my hurt my support man. Uh, everybody's getting up on support man. Okay, 
Okay, support man. Can you get out of the way of these guys without running around everybody? Yeah, yeah, go back, go back, go back. No, uh, no, oh no, you, oh, he, they got him. I am hurting in entirely new places. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's okay. <laughs> Sorry about that, buddy. <laughs> Alright, let's try to take this guy down. Alright, he's down, so that means that because he was that guy, I can get rid of that guy too. Is there anybody else I need to get rid of that I'm just not seeing here? Alright, let's just try to get rid of this man. Okay, he's gone. Good. He was almost dead, but... Okay, I'm also almost dead. So that's amazing. Alright. Wait, you. Don't go get yourself an attack of opportunity because apparently that's how I like to do things. Let's get this man. Still don't have that, so let's get a skin. <laughs> okay. Um. Oh, let's try this. Oh. Oh no, we did a glancing blow. Oh, okay. Fine. Fine. Alright, I probably should have checked. I didn't. Go get you up here so you can do something to these people. Alright, there's this guy. There's another archer. Oh, behind some of us, let's see if we can get him. Oh, for Pete's sake. Okay, well, I'm just gonna have to get up here. Don't go around the map and get okay, fine. <laughs> so, and there we go. That guy's almost dead too, so let's try to get rid of him. I should just punch him down, just punch him. <laughs> Alright. I'll back up. Okay. Alright, in the dirt. Just one more! Yeah. Okay. Archer, can you see these people? Can you see this? This guy? No. I'm gonna have to move up. Anybody? <laughs> All right. I need. I need one more shot at this guy. Sure, come on, can we punch this guy out too? <laughs> no. Oh, no, we got him. No, we didn't. <laughs> He's still alive. Oh gosh. Okay. Fine. <laughs> Exactly uninjured, but we'll take it. Back to Neptune's asshole, barbarians! <sighs> the Triarch has run us straight into the pirate ambush, Freeman. Allow me to execute him right here and right now. This traitor must be walking with them. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, I will say. make him pay for his betrayal. It is quite unusual for pirates to attack any ship, let alone a heavily armed Roman galley. They prefer to attack lightly defended coastal towns instead. It's less risky and more profitable. Well, let's go talk to the man. Alright, where are you? You're still up here? Where are you? Where? Yeah, there he is. Geminus! You steered us into a trap. What do you have to say for yourself? I had nothing to do with it, I promise. They came out of nowhere. Silence! You utter nonsense! By Mars, it is the sea! How can anyone come from nowhere? We cannot execute a man <laughs> based on no evidence. Oh, that's Besides, true. we need our Triarchus to make it safely ashore. Huh. What do you say, kid? What do you think we should do? I'm just a humble Cantorio, albeit a particularly well-dressed one. Lucullus has greater plans for you. Your father's dead. The time to rely on others to make difficult decisions for you is gone. Okay, okay. We are close to our destination, and we can reach it without him. If there is a possibility that he is working with the enemy, we cannot risk to let him live. Mercy, doubt, hesitation. These are all openings that the enemy can exploit to kill you. This man's value to us is far less than the threat he may pose. Well, I mean, we are on a ship. We can't really. We are many of us anywhere. important people on our way to join the action against Lesbos. Is it not conceivable that the rebels heard of us? The Kingdom of Pontus is known to sponsor pirates, to harass and weaken Rome. I do not believe we have any reason to suspect our Triarchus of colluding with them. Well, the evidence is is pretty thin, so I agree. As we are in the middle of the ocean, what's he gonna do? Very well. We shall spare his life. But remember, mercy is a luxury you will not always be able to afford. A wise choice, my friend. Killing the Triarchus of our ship in the middle of the sea would have been inconvenient, indeed. Thank you. Yep. If you ever again need the help of a skilled navigator, I am at your service. Oh, Rowers, more mongering people up don't the like tempo it. and keep your eyes open. All right. So now we get to pick a class. And here's the gear you get over here for each class. Get the best armor type is light, close weapon. A class weapon, excuse me, is a bow. Alright, so these are Sagittarius. These are the archers. Got subclasses, marksman, hunter, sniper. It looks like these correspond these abilities correspond to the subclasses. So get interrupt for marksmen, hunters, get quick shot, snipers, get the ranging shot, you have defense, AoE, and single target damage. So Archer, Princeps, it's like our standard fighter, the soldier, and it's the most straightforward to play, so they say, alright, some classes, defenders, vanguards, veterans, and we've got Brace, Frighten, Knockdown. You get heavy armor. Class weapon is a shield. So you get all the heavy armors. And a hosta. I don't know if I said that right. Probably didn't. This one. Looks like 
like a light weapon, you have medium armor, and a dagger. Can be dual wielded. Assassin. Good mobility and high single target damage. Duelists are evasive fighters that dodge and weave between attacks. And brawlers. Bristol fighters and excel at penetrating enemy lines. Okay, and your abilities. Cheap shot for assassin. Shiv for duelist. And tactical advantage for brawlers. We already looked at this guy. It's the archer. This is our support. Okay, medics. Getting a heal. So healers. Control the battlefield. And buffing allies. Good. Moving enemies. <laughs> Devastating attacks that damage enemy armor. Mm, destroyers. That's not nice. We have logistics, which we already saw with our guy in that fight. Warhorn. And death blow. And they get strong armor. I don't know what the difference between strong armor and heavy armor is. A pike and a staff. Two handed weapons. Shred armor. Okay. That's neat. So that's two armor. So what are the difference between light and heavy? This is medium. That's one armor. Movement minus two. Oh, so the dead stuff. Okay. Light armor minus one. Strong armor has a minus three. Let's just pick. Let's just pick one. Let's go with assassin. There we go. Act one. Asia Minor, first century BC. Gentlemen, Domina, welcome to Lesbos, the pearl of the Mediterranean. <laughs> An ugly nest of pirates. An impenetrable fortress of pirates, more like. With an infinite food supply thanks to the strength of their fleet. We shall find a way to limit this infinite supply, then. You think like an Imperator, Gaius? All right, people. This is Lucullus' war camp, the heart of our operations in this territory. You have been seaborne for a long time now. I suggest you walk it off. See the things you have to see, and meet the people you have to meet. The Consul waits in the command tent. Don't be too late if you don't want to see him angry. A word. Shall I leave you alone, Domini? Stay, Zoe. Your help might be necessary. <laughs> Why are you being shifty? <laughs> shifty? No, no. I'm trying to be discreet. <laughs> I want to make sure we're on the same page. You're not here to fight. Yeah, what if I do want to do it? Your mother has sent you here to be kept safe, away from your family's enemies. To be honest, I don't think it is wise to send one's daughter to war. Actually, I think it's insane. But what I think is unimportant. My job is to protect you. Of course. Oh, okay. All right. Well, well, I think we're going to wrap it up here. But we've had a quick look at the demo for Expeditions Rome, and able to see a little bit of the combat, a little bit of the quest system. So, if you're interested, full game comes out in just a few days on the 20th of January, and or you can check out the demo on Steam. So, yep, yeah, I think that's going to do it for us. Thanks for watching. Bye.